What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music. Thank you again for hanging out and supporting uh, Marty Music. I appreciate it, you guys. It's another Gear Thursday, and I'm going to talk about this interesting little device called the Chord Buddy. Now, this may be controversial because some of you may not uh, believe in learning this way, but I'd love to hear your honest opinions on it. When I first saw this on uh, Shark Tank, actually, I saw it as a as a as a really what I thought was a really good idea, and I'm not getting paid for this. Um, and I met the uh, creator at the NAM show recently. His name's Travis, and he talked about the story of teaching his his uh, I think little daughter how to play, and her fingers weren't strong enough, so he created a little handmade thing with popsicle sticks and little pads underneath uh, to help her start learning chords, so she could actually focus on her rhythm and then eventually take this off to then, you know, build up the strength. So like, like uh, Travis was saying, it's kind of like a training wheel. So it has pads underneath, it goes on the neck. We're gonna use it and check it out. And then you've just got the main chords. You've got a G, a C, a D, and an E minor. And each one of these little pads slides off. So you can actually eventually slide each one off and play for real. Now, the other thing is, you know, rhythm is so important. And when you're a beginner, sometimes you get bogged down with trying to remember the shapes and you're doing the right hand, the left hand. This is really a way to get you strumming and playing recognizable things uh, right away to get your rhythm going. It's not intended to be on the guitar at all, at all times. It's a transitional tool. All right, so it's got these little grooves, and I think I can just slip it on the neck here. All right, so it just tightens on, slides on the neck real easily, and just line the pads up with the string. It's, it's uh, pretty easy. So now that it's on, you've got f uh, four basic chords, and it's a G chord is the blue button, and you know, there's pads underneath. The red is the D, the green is the C, and the yellow is the E minor. C, D, G. So like something like knocking on heaven's door, G, D, and C, now you can focus on strumming, and these are just one button each. Knock, uh, let's see, uh, keep on rocking in the free world. Uh, the yellow is E minor, the red is D, the green is C. And just intuitively, it does require some pressure to press down, so it will get your hand strength going a bit.
right, thanks again for watching uh, this Gear Thursday, you guys. I hope you had fun uh, checking out the Cord Buddy. And uh, let me know what you think. Do you think it would be helpful for uh, beginners and kids alike? Uh, or do you prefer the old-fashioned way? You can let me know in the comments below. And uh, we'll see you again real soon. Nothing.